Hey, what's up everybody? My name is David and welcome to Awesome Tubi Toys. And today I have Decepticon Sweep. And this is a Transformers, the movie 86 series. So you can see right there, it's this 86 Studio series right there. So yeah. And you can get this around $30 because this is like a Voyager class Transformer. You can see his box art and he's number 10 of the Studio series. 86 so look at the box it looks pretty nice um i like the box art you can see it right there it's really cool you can see there's a better picture of him on the side it says 86 on the top it says transforms the movie and in the back it says decepticon sweep and here is sweep and you can transform him into his auto mode it's like a shuttle to me it looked more like a surfboard and you can transform him within 19 steps and back to his robot mode. So that looks pretty nice. Um, yeah, I got it at Target, I think for like $33. And if you're wondering what's the difference between Scourge and Sweep, they're pretty much the same. Just Scourge is more purple and Sweep's more blue. And the hand is on the opposite side. Um, one closed fist, one open hand. So yeah, um, I already have one open already for Scourge. So I can compare them later for you guys. So look at the box from the back. They're almost the same. Just a little bit different color, different shade. And if you watch the Transformers, the movie, and the 86 after in like, I think season three of the G and G1 Transformers, um, you can't really tell them apart. So yeah, so one says Scourge or Scourge and this one says Sweet. So yeah, and the box looks very similar. You can't really tell them apart. this side both say 86 the face is a little bit different right there kind of look funny on one of them so one's number 10 one's number five so today I'm gonna unbox Decepticon sweep so let's put that inside and let's open up and see what's inside the box so if you're new to my channel and have to hit subscribe button, please consider hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to get future notifications on my new video on this channel. And if you like this video, please smash the like button. Don't forget to hit the bell. Uh, don't forget to um, hit the share button also. So here out from the box. And cool thing about Studio 86, always come with the back panel where they have like a picture from the movie. And if you watch the movie, this is where they transform the Decepticons into the Sweeps and Scourge and Cyclonus. So that's the background for it. And this is some warnings. And here's the instruction for Sweep. And just open up. see right there the sweep the transform I think exactly the same nothing different right there you can see so yeah let's take them out from this thing Okay, so everything is out from the box and you can see sweep right here. And you got some weapon and effect parts right here. You just put it on his gun. And you can put it on his hand right there. So he looks pretty awesome. A very G1. Look at his face. You see a Decepticon symbol. His eye is red. So is this the thing on the top of his head. And his, I think he has fingernail polish or something on here. It's red. And in the back. 
So let's compare him to Scourge. They look very alike. So this is more purple and this is more blue. Can't really tell them apart. And compare them side by side. In the back, it's the same mold, just different colors. Yeah, there's no difference. So which one you like better? Um, I recommend you guys getting both if you want to build like a Decepticon army. So let's compare or put them next to each other. You can see they're same size. Let's focus. And this is Cyclonus. Clonus is a Voyager class also, and he's taller. And you want to compare him with his boss, Galvatron. So you can see right there, they look good together. Now they're the own gang now, you see that? It looks pretty nice. So this is a Decepticon gang from the movie, 86. So you can see these guys are a lot bigger and compare him with these guys. So yeah, and let's put them all the way and compare him with Galvatron. Galvatron is huge. You can see right there and he costs a lot more too. So yeah, and let's look at the articulation on this guy. Uh, you can rotate this thing around if you want. And his head, is, I think, is on a ball joint, so he could rotate, and he could look up and down. For his arm, you could do a full rotation, single joint elbow. His fist can't really open or anything; it's just a close fist. Here's like more of an open hand, you can see right there. And also a bend, and let's see if you can rotate this part. I think it's too stiff to do that. Uh, let me see if you can rotate on this torso, spin 360. You can do a back kick, a front kick, and a split. And the knee, you can single joint and knee, you can bend 90. So you can do some kind of pose like this. That's pretty cool. Um, this foot, you can pivot just like the other one. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, one complaint about these guys are, look at this part. It's kind of weird. You see that? I don't really like that. Same with Scourge. I look weird. I think they should have done better with that part. So the difference you can see not only the color but the open hand. This guy has a right open hand. This guy has left. Close fist on the left and close fist on the right right there. They look pretty much the same. Yeah. So yeah let's transform him and see how he looks like. Guys, so just finished transforming these two into odd mode. This is the shuttle mode. To me, it looks like a surfboard. And you can put a shark on it and look like he's surfing. You can see that? Looks pretty cool. And I have two shark -tacons. And they're all going surfing mode. What do you guys think? It's pretty neat, right? Pretty cool and gnarly, dude. So let's take him away. And yeah, as you, can, as you can see, you can mount the gun on the side, but it's kind of funky. It's better when they have both on both sides. So it's better off looking like this and look more cleaner. Here's Sweep compared to Scourge. And you can see the color difference. Um, Decepticon symbol is there, same place. You can see compare. 
comparison. It's more like um, everything's hide on the bottom of the wing. The wing turns into the top part of his alt mode, and here is his head hiding right there. You can see these are the and the weapons where I shoot. If you see in the movies, shoot laser from there, and this in the back. So yeah, what you guys think of this thing? Uh, recommend getting like what three or four of these so you can build like an army looks pretty neat now let's open up and transform him so what you want to do um you want to undo the wing try to you know take it apart like that and try to fold it up and this is on a hinge joint so you want to fold that down like that and the arm and everything is on the side right there so you just want to open the wing up like that and separate this part and get pegged together right there so you just want to open the wing up Let's see I don't want to break this so yeah it's on like a swing joint uh, hinge looks pretty neat so what you want to do, you just want to, now you pull this part up, this is the chest area, and push this back, and push it down, and the head is right there, you see that? And you want to fold this thing down. There you go, so you have to hide this one. You have to bend in a certain way, so this part hinge hide right there. And you wanna close this hinge down so it doesn't expose right there. And now you attack with the arm. It's pegged together up on the bottom on this side, side pegs right there. And swing it back up and you need to peg it together in place. Right there, you pretty much finish with the arms go almost done fold this thing back up like that and I think I'm pretty much done with sweep I think you need to fold this somehow to figure out how to do this and make it look cleaner Yeah, so that's pretty much it. And I think that's how it is. Kind of weird from the back, but it looks clean enough. Way better than the other sweep or scourge that I transformed in the past. And yeah, you can see that. And I turn his arm back, mount his gun. And I guess you can put this effect part on his head with the other transformers. Oh yeah, I forgot to do the leg part right here. So I just have to undo that and open that. Open that up. So yeah, what do you guys think? I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. If you like, please smash the like button. Um, if you have any questions, please leave down in the comment. If you're new to my channel, welcome and please hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to get a future notification of my new video on this channel. And please hit the share button also. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next toy review. Peace.
Thank you.